That's it. I've had it. Hmm. Idea. Job! Success! Hello. Hello. B man, you there? What? Oh, hey. Oh, Jesus. What? Oh. Look who's there. Gave me a start. How are you? I'm great. How uh, are you? I'm I am excellent. I what can I say? I'm doing my own home haircuts. I don't know if you can tell, but I am. Um, it, it looks great. You're about due for another one. Thank you. I know. I, I wish I could say the same about your hair. But they, uh, <laughs> so I, I, I have great news. I have great news. So I knew that you were the what? guy I wanted to get a hold of about this. I was in my garage. As you know, I was trying to do some woodworking. Nothing but sawdust in the face. I got all these, I got a few new tools and they just keep throwing sawdust in my face. I can't stand it. So I looked around the garage and you know it's not like they make something to protect your eyes or face from sawdust they just they don't uh so i actually found a, just a, a a regular old bucket sitting around my garage and i totally upcycled it and repurposed it to to block the sawdust from hitting my face it works amazingly well i just i was so excited i was it's the one time you're always saying how i'm not you know the sharpest knife in the drawer and i just wanted to let you know this time you're half wrong that is amazing. Yeah. That is just like another one of your uh, million dollar ideas. I didn't want to be a braggadocio, but I, I just wanted to call. And, and yeah, this is one of those million dollar ideas, I feel like. And then I got thinking, like, we're home. We need a little side hustle here. Maybe you and I could, like, come up with some ideas mm. or something for, uh, you know, r r items laying around the house. I don't know, like. This yeah, I mean, we've tried this before, and and um, you know, it, like oh, we always get really excited, and then it never it never plays out very well. Uh, what what could we do? Let me let me think. Hmm. What do we got? Well, I mean, this is a tough one. Oh, what, what if? No. Wait, 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 wait. What if? Okay. What if we had our AB and AC students come up with products for us to sell to come up with million dollar ideas? I mean, what else are they doing right now besides e learning for their other teachers? Yeah, but who does that? Let's put them to work for us. All right. And then we can, yeah, we can, we can make them, we can help them help us is what we can do. Brilliant. I, that is brilliant. Why have we not thought of this before? I don't know. So I think what we should do is we should put something out there where they have to take a, an otherwise, you know, household item that they wouldn't really maybe think about and find some alternative use for it that someone hasn't thought of yet, right? Like, because you're not going to be able to sell a mug where you're like, here, put coffee in it. Like, that's not, that's right. Not, that's not it. That's not original. So we've got to, we've got to be able to have an original idea despite having no creativity for you and me ourselves. As they, usual. They can do all the heavy lifting and come up with an idea. Right. I mean, they're so creative. 
They are. I bet we can make not just a million bucks, but a billion bucks yes. on the back of our eighth graders. Billion with a with a B. Yes. And an I. And then and, and, may, and maybe if we go with any of our other ideas, the ones we, we deem worthy, like we'll yeah. send them a free pencil. Ooh, they would work for a pen. Like kids these days, they don't, they with all their stickers. fancy iPads and everything. They would love them. Right. I, feel like. I mean, I'm not going to buy them. You won't buy them. I'll steal them from Wilmette Junior High when we can get that fine. But, uh, you know. From their lockers. Oh, ooh. Yeah, that's a, that's a, that, that feeds itself right there. Right, right there. Yeah. All right. I think this is, a, I think for once. Yes. Mr. Paparonis. Yes. We have a truly winning idea. I agree. I agree. This is very, this is a wolf-like idea. That's what this is. Mm. it is all right well so well maybe said. we'll put some documentation together and throw it up in a folder in schoology yeah find some examples infomercials they can i mean we can find some great examples of infomercials um especially from like you know the 2000s or the, even the 90s they had some great ones back then right like i have like as soon as we get off this call mm -hmm. i'm gonna get on my simply fit board that i've been seeing advertised on cnn when i watch yeah. the news in the morning should i buy several um i mean you're looking pretty fit at least through zoom so i don't think you need to shoulders up only that's what that's my zoom oh well, well true yeah because it's I, I think we've got a i think we've got a great idea we've got a free resource in our mm -hmm. ab and hc students yeah they're 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 ready to go to work they totally are and it's in the name of school work so like i don't think we can get in trouble for like no employing kids that are you know, not paying them for work. I, I, I mean, I don't want to get into that. I mean, I, I'll text Miss Jackson and Mr. Reese's after this. Right. I'm, I'm, I think they'll be like, oh, what, whatever. You know? right. And if they're not, tell them 5% each and then they'll be fine with it. Right. Right. Absolutely. All right. Okay. All right. Well, let's stay in touch. I'm going to go uh, see if I can dig up some, some stuff. I'm not going to try to come up with any more of my own ideas because we know that's not usually a successful endeavor. Um, but I think you've uh, solved it here. You've absolutely okay. solved it. Well, I'm going to go back to my hole now. Okay. All right. Enjoy. I don't know what that is. That's okay. See ya. This is awkward for everybody. Okay. Bye-bye.